Hello, I'm Dan Breen, this is Matt Cavalieri, and welcome to the Dalrod Weekend Preview Show. Okay, well we've got a very important weekend for the Phantoms as on Saturday they travel to Slough to take on the Slough Jets. That's the 6.30 face-off time before returning here to Planet Ice Peterborough on Sunday where they face the Sheffield Steel Dogs with a 5.30 face-off. Now Matt, the Phantoms are coming off a very tough weekend um, and really although they haven't gained any points, really the positions at the bottom of the table I mean this is going to be a very important weekend for pretty much all the teams involved. That's right Dan, yeah. Now I mean this this week, Phantoms actually dropped to ninth position in the league with uh, just uh, 15 points. Um, they actually have a game in hand on the four teams above them, though. Uh, as you can see, fifth through ninth spots in the standings are extremely close, with the Jets now claiming the fifth spot in, uh, this week on 19 points, and the Steel Dogs resting on top of the Phantoms with 17. So just four points separate these teams, and that has in turn created a playoff atmosphere for the bottom half of the standings, and that's going to make each game a must-win for each team moving forward. Indeed. Now, on Saturday, the Phantoms face the Slough Jets down in um, Berkshire. Now, the Slough Jets themselves are coming off a very tough weekend. Obviously, there's been various off-ice comments and mm. player changes. And on the ice, Slough Jets losing 4-3 to the Swindon Wildcats on Saturday before crashing quite spectacularly 6-2 against the Bracknell Bees. Now, looking at this, um, the Jets' scoring has been led by their imports. Mm. Um, most notably Darius Pliskauskas. Now he's picked up 18 goals and 11 assists for a combined 29 points. Now, I mean these are obviously two very important points for both sides, us and the Slough Jets on Sunday, on Saturday rather. Now, Sunday on the other hand, now this is a game that I'm very much looking forward to where we face the Sheffield Steel Dogs. Absolutely, Dan, yeah. So this is actually going to be the fourth time that the Phantoms have faced the Steel Dogs this season. Um, the Steel Dogs, uh, on the other hand, though, they have ha actually come off a pretty dreadful weekend themselves, actually going down 10 goals to two uh, against the top-seeded Guildford Flames. Mm. Uh, the Steel Dogs actually defeated the Phantoms in the opening game of the season on September the 21st by a score of 4-3. to three. And then the Phantoms then defeated the uh, Sheffield 4-1 at home on October the 20th before losing in overtime 4-3 in Sheffield the following weekend on October the 27th. So Sheffield's scoring has uh, been led by their Czech import Lubomir Kohan, who has 18 goals and 18 assists for the season. And that actually leads all, all Steel Dogs forwards um, so far. None of the others have actually hit any double digits so far this season. Mm. Now it's actually because of the sc scoring between Slough and Sheffield as well that really this week we focus on net Phantom Netminders, Damien King and Tom Murdy as uh, the best of Peterborough players to watch this weekend. That's right, Matt. Now, the Phantoms didn't have the best of weekends last weekend, so all eyes really going to be on the Phantoms defensively, which starts really in the nets with our two netminders who, let's be honest, they're going to be looking to return to the kind of form they've shown over the last few weeks. Mm. The duo themselves, Tom Murdy, Damien King, they've combined for five Man of the Match awards so far this season, and really their presence is going to be a must this weekend. Mm, absolutely, yeah, but it's not to forget as well, there are five other guys out there on the ice as well, so it really is a team effort. Can't really fault that. Mm. Okay, well, that'll do us for this edition of the Dalrod Weekend Preview Show. We'll be here on Sunday at 5.30 when Peterborough Dalrod Phantoms will take on the Sheffield Steel Dogs. So, I've been Dan Breen, this is Matt Cavalieri. Good night. Good night.